This morning, we've also got new details of the Ford production plan in Clay Como after it was evacuated Tuesday evening, investigating a possible armed man barricaded inside. Let's get to our reporter Caroline Hogan. She's out there this morning. Caroline, what's the latest? I mean, they were searching pretty and much until recently this morning, right? All night long, Daisha and Lindsay. Actually, the latest update is that they found no one inside the plant behind me that is a threat to the building. They finished their investigation this morning. But let me take you back to how this all happened. Take a look at your screen. Here's video from yesterday evening. They had about five different agencies out here investigating the entire place. The, the sheriff's office said a man called the call police saying he was a disgruntled employee who was barricaded inside with explosives and weapons. So everyone from the plant, of course, was sent home. Highway 69 in front of the plant was also shut down during the investigation. It is now opened and no shots were fired. Another update is that we know that the United Auto Workers Local 249 has posted on Facebook. They said that normal ships will continue here this morning. Right behind me, we believe around 5 or 6 a.m. we'll start to see more people come in. We also should have more details from the sheriff's office at 10 a.m. Deshaun Lindsay. All right, Caroline Hogan reporting live for us. Caroline, we'll check in with her later on this morning. Thank you so much. We'll